Stand by for action. Welcome to the Mr. Roy Show on SRB Radio with him, Mrs. Brown, and me, the Gabby Cabby, supporting Super Josh's charity, Explore Gambia and Autism Birmingham. On tonight's show, we have music from Paris Toon and Mother's Favourite Child featuring Tanya Teat, Fleck Pets and Puppet Rebellion. That's one hell of a mouthful. Plus a whole lot more and regular features. The 400 Club, Twitter Time, Agony Uncles, Yesterday's Papers, Channel 4, All Channel 5 and The Colin Val End. But as always, let's get kicked off with one from Weller in conjunction with Protect. And this week, it's long time. Take it away, God. Long time by Paul Weller. It doesn't last a long time, though, does it? It doesn't, no. It lasts two minutes and something. Two minutes and 12 seconds. Yeah. And I'm not yeah. even looking at the screen. He actually starts... He started his gig at the Water Carts with that one. At the moment of watching him, I didn't actually know what it was. But it's been a long time since we were uh, on air as well, because we had a week uh, off, haven't we? Yeah. yeah. Why well, didn't we have a week off? I forgot now. Your missus had a week off. Oh, that's and, right. Yeah, and if yeah, she caught yeah. us, she'd like, we wouldn't be able to mm, do it ever again. So that's right, yeah. we had to play the party game, didn't we? Yep. There's a lot of party games being played at the moment. <laughs> there is. A do you know there's an election, election going on? Uh, you know what? Bores I think me. I've just got old. Yeah. And I, I just, I have no interest whatsoever. We'll talk about parts. Yeah. Sarah. Yeah, Walsall went to Wembley. Didn't do very Walsall, well, though. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Mm. Yeah, in front of 72,000. Yeah, we'll talk about party politics after, because I think it's quite fascinating. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's probably Cameron. You ain't getting my vote. Do one. Jog do on. One. Do one. Jog on. Anyhow, before we... Uh, and we must we must state and stress that One From Weller, always in conjunction with Protect, that's all the W's, childrensprivacy.co.uk. Another little plug there for Hannah Weller and her mm. wonderful charity. Right, let's invite the world into our... Are you ready? I'm ready. Monkey Okay. 
lights just till the lights go down We're gonna be rich tonight We're gonna be huge We're gonna be rich tonight We're gonna be na 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 In America, that's boy weekly, isn't it? Oh, you call him boy. Uh, in England, it's fortnight. Yeah. Do they say fortnight? Don't they think do in they? America, no. Oh, AJS. We love you, Jimmy. We we'll love you. We we'll love you. Yeah. To all our American listeners. we got low. We're massive in America, haven't we? Oh, we're massive. We're mar- massive all over the world, to be fair. Yeah. But in America. Actually, I am massive. I've just eaten three... Three yeah. boxes of Jaffa cakes that were out of date. You're Thank joking. you, Doco. You're joking. I didn't know they were out of date. I give you the squirts. It did, actually, yeah. yeah. Would, uh, yeah. Chocolate yeah. And does. And the two bobbits. Yeah, chocolate does do that, you know. Yeah. Out of date chocolate. You ever played football at Cadbury's? No. Nope. When the kids were little. You see, when you're like little and you're playing under 10s, you oh, can yeah. get away with it. But you try and put an adult on the pitches under 10s, they don't like you too old. You'd get away with yeah, it. Yeah, well, I probably would, to yeah. be fair. But um, we played at Cadbury's a couple of times, and they sell you chocolate in the clubhouse. I know. Yeah, it's all our days. Yeah. Uh, of geez. course, yeah, they ain't getting you. No. Club. Have you ever been on the Cadbury's tour? No. No? No. Ooh, when you go around, you get a little, little cup of fluid chocolate. And it's yeah. warm and it's beautiful. So is it like just like drinking chocolate? No. Ah. It's like pure chocolate. Right. Not drinking chocolate. Pure chocolate. So, because I mean, Cadbury's. I mean, they, they've been taken over now by... Um, Somehow, somebody else. Kraft. 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 Kraft American Company. Mm. And there's been... Well, they've changed the recipe for the Cadbury's cream egg just coming up, you know, coming up to Easter. Mm. It's going to be a different cream egg. It's a different chocolate. They're using a different grade of chocolate, aren't they? Cheap. 
But it's still nice. Mm. It is, ain't it? Uh, well, we're not connoisseurs of chocolate, so we're not gonna we're not gonna know the the difference, are we? No, really? it tastes bloody nice, don't it? Don't we done the size we us. done we done the Cadbury's cream egg test about four weeks ago. Mm. I tell you what, I thought it tasted better than what it did before. Mm. I do like a cream yeah. egg. Tell you what, I don't like Bourbon chocolate. Now that's strange. Why? Why don't you like it? I love the dark chocolate from. That's what I'm saying too. Yeah, you don't like it. No, they used to in the olden days. It used to be called like Bourneville, and it was in a red wrapper. Yeah, and it was dark chocolate. They still do it. Oh, do they? Of course they do. I've never liked dark chocolate. I mean, oh, no. I love it. Now, if you stuck a bit of get this, a bit of mint in there, mm. a bit of like. Aero, because Aero is a kind of darky chocolate, isn't it, to a milk chocolate? Yeah. Have you ever tasted real dark chocolate? I'm talking about no. connoisseur's dark chocolate. I like it in yoghurt. No. This is real dark chocolate, and it's like bitter and salty. Really? Yeah. Do you like it? It's lovely. It's lovely. I tweeted up one of my favourite biscuits last night. Would you say Jaffa Cakes your favourite biscuits, yeah, although they're not a biscuit? I'm afraid, yeah, 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 yeah. You can't have one, can you? I'll tell you something, right? I do like You can't Jaffa- have one box, can you? <laughs> well, <laughs> evidently you can't. Well, I'll tell you what, if there was a Jaffa Cake box and, do you know, I can't even remember what these are called, but they're a digestic, they're a McVitie's biscuit, mm. right? They're a chocolate do McVitie's make the only chocolate digestive biscuits, or do other people make digestive biscuits? I can never get the brand in me biscuits. Who makes Hobnobs? I think McVitie. They make quite a lot, don't they? And don't United Biscuits own the bloody lot of them? Yeah. Basically. So, um, this, there's, there's this, right, chocolate digestive. Do you know what's underneath? Between the chocolate and the biscuit, there's a layer of caramel. Oh, mm. my God, man. Nice. Oh, I tell you, not doing my teeth very good. No. Mind you, tell you what, my dentist did it all right last week. That's what you did. That's what you did last week. Yeah, you? I know I did. Yeah, you was in agony, weren't you? Oh, you right, right. right. Me, me yeah. mouth was proper out there last week. It was, week, wasn't it? Though. Yeah, yeah. Well, I had to have uh, work done for a crown. Can you stop your talking, Bolo? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I had to have work done for a crown. Yeah. Right. So she's like drilling. I've got my mouth open. And surprising, she kept saying to me, can you open your mouth a bit more? <laughs> Which is rather unique because everyone usually tells me to shut it. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, so I thought I'm making the most of this. Mm. And I tell you what, I have only got a little mouth. I have. You know, and me, look yeah. at my mouth. Yeah, it's small, isn't it? Small eyes, small eh? Small yeah. Eyes. You have got a small mouth. And small eyes, look. I've got yeah. big eyes. And all. Your eyes are like Morocco moles. In fact, you look a bit like Morocco mole. A cross between Morocco and Mole and that bloke that owns, what's that place, North Korea, him. Kim sung Young. Yeah, do him. I can't, my hair's not grown. No, when, no. Me, when my hair gets a bit higher, then I can do him. But anyhow, this chocolate biscuit, oh. mate, so yeah. And then the dentist, right. And like, she's drilling me, like, you know. <laughs> nice girl. What's First time it? I'd ever had her. <laughs> <laughs> right. You're always a bit sceptical, aren't you, with new dentists and doctors yes, and know, stuff yeah, like yeah. that, do you know what I mean? They don't know your ins and outs, you're no. a bit of, you know, when you scream, ah, that yeah. usually means it hurts, mm. but the new one probably doesn't realise that. So usually, my old dentist, like he'd say, <laughs> exactly, you know, yeah. I grab him by the, you know, and say we're yeah. going to hurt each other, are we? But I can't with her. Yeah. And she's younger than my kids. Mm. That's quite scary, really. You I mean, if you've ever been a dentist and it's not hurt, it's always hurts, doesn't it? Well, putting a drill in your mouth and like it's switching it on generally yeah. does hurt a bit. Yeah. That's why they freeze it. But anyhow, she was doing what my tooth was bleeding, right? And uh, <laughs> which wasn't a surprise, no. really. No, no, you no. know, gums and round there. So she said, "Go and sit in the waiting room and like bite onto this gauze." So there, I'm like, biting on there for fifteen minutes. And my mouth feels, my mouth feels like the size of a district, right? It really does. And, and it didn't stop me tweeting. I was tweeting up, but mm-hmm. think, you know. And um, I've, she's called me back in, Mr. Collins. Thank you. So I'm walking back in, she's gone. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you know, it didn't feel me with confidence. Could go either way. I know, yeah. Let's hope, eh? Yeah. Just sign this declaration, will you? <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah. So, oh. While I was having my, my mouth drilled, what was you having done? Last week? Yeah. Uh, nothing, I don't think. You've had a peaceful week, haven't you? 
peaceful, yeah. What, we didn't have any peace on Friday night, we did we, baby? We did we? Where was we on Friday? We were. What a fantastic event that exactly. was. Exactly. The event. Con Club yeah, Champs yeah. League. Our first live at the Con Club. Yeah. Fantastic host. Thanks, everybody, for turning up. Mm. And also, Moon Sugar. What a great, what band. A great We've band. We've got a track by them We're later. Gonna play. We're going to play that. Next and when... Actually. Oh, we're playing Justify yeah, next. Yeah, Brilliant. Next. Someone that's going to have to justify herself. Mm. Is that Bird? Who was playing with herself up a tree? Did you yeah, see that? To be honest... Tree woman. Oh, I saw the picture and I never read the story. I read a bit of it. Well, I thought you might... The, yeah, the tree's name was Tim. She loves Tim. Mm. That was going to be my question. I mean, I, was it? Has she given it a name? Yeah, Tim. Tim. And she couldn't like. If she hugged another tree and had an orgasm up another tree, mm. she'd feel. Well, first, Tim would have been. Yeah, oh, he would have been a bit, yeah, no. bit cheesed off, wouldn't he? Yeah, but um, two timing. I know. But she'd have felt like she was cheating on Tim, mm. so he's the only tree. I mean. I look at trees. Do you look at trees and think, oh, I think you look beautiful? Yeah. I never think I want to like, rub myself no, up yeah. No, no, no. What trees do you think are the most beautiful trees like out oak. there? I like a good oak. Do you? Yeah, I like mm. a good oak. Yeah. I like the cherry blossom. Do you? Yeah, I do. And it comes out now. It's Yeah, they are. They're coming out just outside here now, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, I like, I like a good cherry blossom. But I like a nice oak. Bottom of my garden, where I used to have a garden. Well, I used to have a house. Mm. Right. Yeah. See that bloke? What have you got now, then? Well, they have, but it's not my house. Oh, right. I okay. just live there. Yeah. You know. um, but I used to have... Well, I'm quite an orchard. <laughs> what? Do you... How many trees do you need? An apple tree. <laughs> <laughs> they were apple trees. They have, they have them blossoms and all, don't they? They do, yeah. But yeah. These... Apple blossom. Yeah. But these, these cherry trees... Cherry trees don't have apples, do they? Uh, no, I don't think they do. <laughs> These are cherry trees. And an odd apple tree as well. Uh, yeah. And I had white ones and pink ones. Uh, maybe the trees got together, I don't Yeah. Uh, but I must have had about six or seven, so would that constitute an orchard? I suppose it would, actually, yeah. Uh, yeah. So with a riot in it, you need about... Oh, you need more people yeah. for a riot, do you? Yeah. yeah, you do. Before that, it's a punch-up, innit? It is, yeah. 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 I predict it was. Yeah. Hey, sex pistols. Oh, yes. How fantastic are they? Mm, brilliant. They filled the O2. Do you see them pictures of all the people camping outside to watch mm. the sex pistols? Tell you what, so... Nance and them girls, they are off the scale. Yeah. And in Birmingham on the 7th of May at the wonderful Roadhouse. You coming with me? Probably not. You don't get out much, do you? I don't you? get out much. I'm too busy. I'm yeah. doing shows. I noticed when you did come out to record the uh, live out, you brought the wife with you. She wanted to come. You like Simon's yeah. twins, didn't you? Oh, sister, if you want to come, come. Which is nice. Yeah. I picked them up once, you know. Simon's twins? Yeah. Lolly, Lolly, I Both think. Them. Yeah, they had to come together. Uh, item. They, um, it was ever so funny. Well, it wasn't funny. Mm. But, you know, it was strange. Which one paid? They were at the BBC. Do you remember the old Pebble Mill at One when I was a black I cab do, driver? Yeah, yeah. They I were went down, there once. Yeah, they were down at Pebble Mill at One. So it was like on the account at the BBC. But it was like, I think it was Laurie and Dory or something yeah. like that, the Siamese twins. The one was like, you know, and the other one was a little one that came out of her head. Oh, right. Yeah. American. I believe they were American. Oh, I think I, 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 think I I'm saw a documentary. I'm sure they will. Yeah, yeah. Nice girls. I had a really yeah. great conversation with them. From, like, Deep South? I can't like remember where they yeah, were from. Laurie, Laurie and Dory, yeah. I'm sure the names. Yeah, saw the documentary. And yeah. um, they they have different boyfriends as well, you know. Yeah, yeah. And also, when the one got a cold, the other one didn't necessarily get that cold. Mm. And it was not ever so. They, they were really, really nice. But that was one of the one of the jobs uh, as a black cab driver in Burn. I really, really remember that. Really, mm. yeah. And were they with somebody else or on the road? Yeah, they were with the per- person from the BBC that's taken oh, right, down there. Okay. I mean, I knew where the BBC was because a black cab driver, but they didn't, did they? They're from mm. America. Anyhow, let's uh, let's have a bit of moon sugar. Hey, did you see the moon eclipse? Wasn't that the moon? Wasn't eclipse? it spooky that it was on the same day as our moon sugar? I know. Dig? I was in Edgebaston as well. I was in Edgebaston the last two. Did you mm. find it strange that people were jumping up? Well, not jumping up buildings, but getting up to the top of a block yeah. of flats to get a better 
like yeah. view of it. I thought it was absolutely fascinating because I was actually doing a quote uh, uh, on a large office building in yeah. town at the exact time it was happening. Okay. Uh, and I thought it was strange. Everybody was coming out of the offices to have a look at something they couldn't have a look at. I know. Well, <laughs> what? you could look Apart at it. the one bloke with the welding mask, he did yeah. look at it too. Yeah. yeah. But you could look at it if you put a piece of paper, you put a pinprick and look yeah. to ref- watch the reflection. Do you understand that? No. Why would you want to do that? Well, again... I could do that, yeah. Yeah, I know, and you'd see the reflection of it. But there was people literally piercing holes in cornflake box, putting the cornflake box up. actually. Yeah. You're never so good. Can you do a rabbit? Yeah, I can do a rabbit. No, I can't do a rabbit. Rabbits are hard to do. Yeah. But, but what I didn't get, and, and, and I couldn't get my head round it, is, as I say, going on to the top of a building... Getting a better view of something that's 93 million miles away. Amazing. Crazy, isn't it? Crazy. Yeah. Let's have a bit of moon sugar. Okay. We are the Sex Pistols and you're listening to NRB Radio. We're so pretty, oh so pretty. Singer, Aidy Shaw, what a top lad as well, Aidy, is not he? Rockstar. He is, isn't he? Uh, can Love I just them. say what a fantastic night that was as yeah. well? Great. And, and they're pretty good live, so if you get a chance to go and see them, get out there. Pretty good. Yeah. Smashed it, mate. Brilliant. Smashed Absolutely. it. And, and, and people will know how good they are when they listen to our, uh, our, our show that we recorded, which should go out on Friday. If someone the, gets their finger Wind out. in the right direction. Yeah. Friday, 8pm. 
Tell you well, what, worth a listen. Oh, absolutely. Um, somebody else has got to justify themselves. That referee. Oh, yeah. God blimey. Hey, mistaken yeah. identity again. Crazy. Unbelievable, uh, isn't it? Our yeah. refs are getting worse. They're oh, getting no. some great positions, though. You're right there. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying to multitask. I know, you're never so good at that. We've got to keep up with our fans. I know, yeah. yeah they, they um, I mean, the one thing that I've noticed with referees, I mean, some of the decisions they've been making recently are awful, aren't they? But they are getting, you know, they're on the spot. They're almost like Johnny on the spot. There's, there's not a lot wrong with the refs, apart from the making the wrong decisions when they get there. Mm. I mean, I almost feel that, like, pass the ball, square the ball to the ref. He's in a great position to score. Oh. I mean, I'm he sure. He never scores, does he? No, he don't. I'd love him to, though. Be great, wouldn't he? I wonder, if I wonder if one ever has scored. I bet one has in Brazil. Yeah. In South America, they do stuff like that, don't they? Did you see the physio that saved the ball from going in the net? I think it was in Brazil. No. It was a while back on Facebook. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. It was probably drawing or winning, you know, is it, 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 and it was probably a local derby. It was a, probably a game that meant, you know, life and death, basically. And um, it was a physio. No game is no game is life or death. It would have if the fans would have caught him. I suppose so. Yeah, I promise you. I tell you what, he didn't half leg it. And he just about, you know, when you were a kid and you were playing the game, like, say, British Bulldog. British Bulldog, yeah. one, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three. Ali Barley. Yeah, Ali Barley. Fingers you're in your safe, yeah, you're in your uh, safe yeah. zone, Ali Barley. Ali Barley. And he just about, Ali Barley, whack the door. Yeah. A little bit like the transfer window, you know, and it slams shut. And he, like, slammed the door and, like, all the fans are, like, waiting, trying to kill him. Mm. I bet he stayed in there for about three weeks until they were, because they're in Brazil and stuff like that. They'd stay there for that length yeah. of time. Oh, your journey and Harley Barley. Oh. It doesn't work there, does it? Harley Barley. No, I don't think so. Could you imagine him coming out and giving Harley Barley? He was only joking. Yeah. Yeah, get some wolf. Yeah, come out too. We'll do some Harley yeah. Barley. Yeah. Some Harley Barley up your jacks, eh? Yeah. Party politics as well. Mm. A lot of that goes on. And also with football. Yeah. Hey, we've adopted a footballer. We have. Yeah. Have we? Birmingham City Ladies. Oh, right. Which one is it? Kirsty Lynette. Kirsty Lynette. And you can follow Kirsty at Kirsty underscore Lynette. Well, you know how to spell Kirsty, don't you? Mm, Kerr. Big Kerr. Yeah, Kerr. 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 Kicking Kerr. Kicking Kerr, yeah. Yeah. As in Kirsty Allstrop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Lynette is ally, double N, E, double T. Ah, right, okay. Not the Phil Lynette, the other Lynette. No, exactly, with an I. Okay. Ally, double N, E, double T. And Kirsty is um, one of the central strikers at Birmingham City Ladies. They're doing well, aren't they? Uh, I'll tell you what, that that was a fantastic result on Sunday. And it wasn't expected for them to do so well this season. To be I, w- I would say, apart from when we won the, when we was going to say when we won the World Cup, when we won the FA Cup um, on that penalty shootout mm. against Chelsea a couple of years back, um, I'd say that was probably the best result Blues Ladies have ever had. You know. Postman. Postman. Mm-hmm. Never knocks, does it? No. Always rings, twi- always rings twice. Does a postman always knock or always ring twice? Knocked, postman always knocks then. twice, don't they? Why not be doing something? They yeah. do that. If no one's in, then they enter, don't they? You know what I mean? Mm. But no, they, um, they played the champions of the WSL, Liverpool. Mm. Liverpool are a great side. Yep. Matt Beard, I believe him. He, I believe he's still the manager. I've been out the game for a while. Yeah, and I, you haven't, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't do much football now. I've done well since you've been out the game. So. I tell you what, they all do well, Pop. You know, <laughs> they do they seriously? <laughs> and I, I look at it. I thought <laughs> blues. They're better off without me, really. Yeah. But um, I have put it to Birmingham City ladies about with the bands that that we're working with and the some you know some of the unsigned music that we're playing, and I think we could get a nice little link up there. Where we could uh, Stadium, introduce... They could, be, they could become... Bands could, could become stadium rockers. Well, you see, the establishment on the first football ground tour, mm. literally, they you know, Goodison and Anfield. I tried to go to St Andrews, but Blues w- wouldn't answer me an email. Yeah, but, yeah. but I do... Certainly at the Boom City Ladies now, um, they are answering me, and I'm, I'm talking to the ladies, hopefully. When I, well, I would have spoken to them, because this is Tuesday morning. Mm-hmm. Tuesday afternoon, I'm talking to him. Uh, yeah. Hey, I'm talking to him. Oh, yeah? How come? 
Next Tuesday. Yeah. No, I keep, why do I keep saying I Tuesday? don't know. Next, Tilton Talk. Next Monday, Monday Tilton yeah. Talk. Or Ladies Night. Because the internationals. There's no, there's no, it's no, and we're going to play that. And the feelings, right? right. This is ladies night. Oh, what a night. Oh, do, what do you remember that other song, Celebration? Let's Say, celebrate good times. Come on. got to do with Ladies Night? No, well, when I was a PA person playing yeah. all the songs, yep. the, um, the Beau Brummy, they had to do a dance. They were picking, you'd have to tweet up. There was a competition that the W, the FAWSL were, were playing. And there was, there was two songs that, that was up. It was either Celebration or Footloose, Footloose, Get Out of the Damn Blues. Kick off the Sunday Goose. I don't know. Would you? Well, I don't means. know. Some lyrics just don't. Yeah. Silly Have lyrics. you ever done that? Made up your own lyrics? Because do you don't really know. Like, yeah, like my daughter. Do you know artists do that as well? You know, mm, like my daughter. What she do? Remember, I told oh, her. Oh God, that hey, was. Geez, stay, she thought for years yeah. it was not staying, staying alive. alive. It was staying alive mm. because it was dancing. Sing the line, sing the line. Well, you sometimes can't hear what artists do singing. I'm sure that no. sometimes they do that on purpose. Mm. But in here, the competition was, it was kind of, one not even neck and neck. Footloose was absolutely battering the opposition. but And I was told I've got to play Footloose because it's won. But I didn't have it. So I played Celebration. Same thing. And it was, I, I think I'm right saying it's five minutes, five seconds long. And Bo Brummy had to dance <laughs> to, to the Celebration. Oh, no. Hold on, I'll start it again. <laughs> I was I've like never seen pig. that dog dance so much in my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, Bo, let's play another one. <laughs> Going for a bowl of water. For our American listeners, what is Bo? Bo Brom is Birmingham City's official mascot. And he's got a bird as well now, Bell. Bell? Yeah. yeah. Nice, nice. I'm amazed they ain't had a little Bo Brummy by now. Oh, that's got to happen soon. Got to, in yeah, it. A puppy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bo puppy Bo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> For the younger, yeah, you know, yeah. for the junior blues, it, it's got to happen, innit? Yeah. Mind you, you know what questions are going to get there, then? Mum, Dad. How did they? Yeah. yeah. How did the puppy bow come about? Yeah. Opens a can of worms, don't yeah. it? Diagrams. So you what's also you opened a can of worms. Adam and Eve. Can I just get back to the Tilton Talk Show? Oh, I'm sorry. So anyway, Tilton <laughs> Talk Show, next <laughs> Monday, 7.30, yeah. we've yeah. got a... Uh, Expert in in uh, women's football. An so expert. Chris, expert. An expert. An expert. Okay. An expert. Yeah, don't say what I'm saying. An expert. Of course he does. You can't say because he's an expert. expert. Ah, if you're going to say mm. we're bringing in a expert. We're getting back to there and there. Oh, the English language. Don't know. Do no. Anyway, we've got an expert, Chris Pugh. Yep. We've also got Tim Andrews. You know Tim Andrews very well, don't you? <gasps> oh! Oh. The kids used to love that when I'd done the PA. Did they? Oh, I went on for ages. I don't believe that. Uh, you asked him. Mm. You, I'll tell you what, you, when he comes into the Tilt and Talk, say, Tim, what was Gabby's Hollywood monster like? Legendary. Honestly. <laughs> like. uh, and also, I have it. I, I believe we're going to have a player as well. From the team. Karen. Yeah. No. Not Kaz. Mm. How come? Mm, 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 not Karen. Do you know who the player is? No, but it won't be Karen. Oh, is Karen playing? No, it She's won't be Karen. For country. It won't be Karen. Oh, okay. Um, Our centurion, what? A, the Georgie best of the female, yeah. female, female game. Into the, um, yes, uh, well done, Kaz. Blues. Me mate. Fantastic. Yeah. Brilliant. And oh, also an ambassador of uh, Solo Wars as well. What? I tell you what. A beautiful young lady. And it person. was quite historic because it would be the first time we've ever had a current player. Yeah. From Birmingham City. Yeah. In our studio. Well, you were going to have one then, you sacked me, didn't you? Yeah. And it never come out. I told no, you it no, wouldn't, no, did I? No, and Lee no, Clark's no. done one. Yeah. They're not very happy with him at Blackpool, no other, are they? I can't, I, I can understand why, can't you? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, was I wrong? Yeah. I've never been wrong, have I? Well, you know, quite a, quite a few times. You hey, know, but it's the turn of the month. Oh, this is the time of the month. Then. No turn of the month. I don't mm. have them. Mm. Do you think we might have new owners? Well, we were promised these new owners two years ago. 
Yeah, and two weeks ago. Yeah, they were going to. It was going to happen the next day, wasn't it? Yeah, it never happened, did it? I've heard. Well, I don't listen to nothing really. No. But it's supposed to. Because be. being in the media, because like, we're in the media, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, of course. We, we are. get these little snippets, made, don't yeah. we? A little few little nudges. <coughs> oh, oh, oh shit! Yeah, yeah, it really. This could happen. This could happen. Yeah, you know. But don't tell anybody. The sky might fall in. It's a bit like yeah. chicken licking, isn't it? Yeah, chicken yeah. licking. Do you remember yeah. that? Yeah, no, I used to. I used to love them books. I gave up reading books after that. To be mm. He got when the, the duck and he went, he went through all of his mates, didn't he? Mm. The sky's falling in, the sky's falling in. Oh, must have traumatic. I know, little chicken as well. Yeah. But this is such a su- subtle, a subtle and a gentle and an easing in link. Chicken and the egg. What come first? Don't know. Chicken. Exactly. No one knows. Have you seen the picture of Adam and Eve on Facebook? No. Belly button. Oh, of course, yeah. Oh, that's an old belly button. Yeah, yeah, belly oh, is it? Yeah, uh, yeah. How does he get a belly button? Why, they got, why has he got a belly button? Don't mm-hmm. need one, did they? Don't need one. Shouldn't have had one. No. Said to my, I showed my missus that. Mm-hmm. Said, to you, oh, look, because she's a Catholic mm-hmm. and a believer. Catholic. Yeah, I'm, mm-hmm. I mean, I'm not. Yeah, I just don't feet. believe. No. Really. No, that's you know, rubbish. live and let live. You know. <laughs> Always amazes me when you go, um, you know, do you believe in ghosts? Mm-hmm. And they'll go, like, nah. Never seen a ghost, I'm believing. Hey, I've just got to kick my computer. Well, what are you doing? Oh, is he making. Oh, the it? buzzing sound's gone. Yeah, kick it. Oh, what's next down there? Yeah, and they'll say, Do you believe in UFOs? Nah, don't be stupid. Yeah. You believe in God? Oh, yes, of course I do. Mm. Mm. But anyhow, I showed her and she said, What do you mean? There's no like, they've got a belly button. Everyone has a belly button. I said, Yeah, of course they do. But think about it. No, perhaps not, Bab. Don't worry uh, about it. You just carry on and watch the voice. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right, come on then. Let's get into what we got to know, baby. Well, we've got a load of music oh, today. What were we just? How much what, music? Were we, what were we just talking about? Um, rubbish, really. I'm no, before about that, rubbish. Before that, that was going to be the link into the next song. Oh, was we going to? Oh, blimey! Do you know we should write some of these things down, shouldn't we? We should, yeah. We're back to to blues, ladies, aren't we? We are. Well done. <laughs> thanks for follow. Thanks for following the carefully prepared script. <laughs> We don't have a script, we just chuck it oh, together no, no, and we just go off on one. No, no, but no. we're going to bring it in. You know when you've got a fishing rod and yeah. you've caught the really? fish yeah, yeah. and you're reeling it back in. So as we've gone out, right, mm. we've gone out to Adam and Eve. Yeah. We've gone back a long time in time. Nobody can see what you're doing, by no. the way. But I've got a fishing rod. You've got a fishing rod. And yeah, I'm bringing one. it back in like that. Back oh, in, baby. Oh, coming yeah, back know. in. Because yep. you never told me what time the Tilton Talk show's on. I did, but you never listened. Uh, Seven thirty PM every Monday. www.srbradio.com. Is Nick still doing it? It's ninety minutes. Do you ever have any arguments? We have some fantastic arguments. Do you? Yep. Are they as good as when I used to argue? Better. Really? Yeah. Who's the annoying little? Better because now people don't get go purple when they're arguing. (laughs) 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 It's actually in good (laughs) humour. <laughs> There's no fist flying. Or There's nothing. no fist flying. No, mm. no, no, no. There's no. I ain't coming back. Your fees back again. No, 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 no. no, no, no. no. Your no. fees here next week. I ain't coming in. No, no. It's good show. I'm. No. I, in all honesty, last night's show was yeah. a cracking show. So Brilliant. Yeah, well worth a listen. Oh, well, I definitely will next week. Mm-hmm. And uh, Kirsty Linnet, our star striker. Maybe you could phone in on Skype. Ah, oh, that'd be great, wouldn't it? I bet you don't. I don't know how to do it. You'll have to put... I know I've you got press Skype. You've green button <laughs> and you phone in. I know, but you need people on Skype to Skype, don't you? Oh, I yeah, need yeah. to accept you or you accept me, don't you, to Skype yeah, to them? Yeah. yeah well, well, not necessarily. Oh, okay. I'll show you All right, show me what I would like to say. Anyhow, so, Kirsty yeah. is going to send in a track every week and this is Kirsty Lynette's track this week. Call me out. Why am I soft in the middle now? Why am I soft in the middle? The rest of my life is so hard. I need a photo opportunity. I want a shot of redemption. Don't want to end up a cartoon in a cartoon graveyard. Bone digger, bone digger, dogs in the moonlight. Far away, my well-lit door. Just a beer, man, a beer, man. Get these mutts away from me, you know. I don't find this stuff amusing anymore. If you be 
Can call me Al Paul Stevens. Al Paul, Paul Stevens. Stevens. Paul Stevens. Stevens. Paul Stevens. That's his brother, isn't he? Yeah, no, they have to have the same surname, wouldn't it? Yeah. Like Simon. So Paul Simon's brother. If he's got, has he got a brother? If he did, it'd be say Kevin Simon. You know. You've gone yeah. off into another like, completely new dimension. Whose brother was you on about then? I don't know what you're talking about. You, I said Paul. I mistakenly said Paul Stevens. I don't yes. know why. Do you know what I think? Oh, of, do you know what I think? Don't of, want one. Yeah, I don't have that problem. Oof. Don't need as many crisps. Um, do you know why I probably, probably say that Paul Stevens? Because that's my that's my middle name. Is it? Stephen, yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah. So if I slight say Paul, <sighs> yeah. where's that ball? <laughs> <laughs> do you know when you yawn, it's yeah. infectious. It's like a smile. If I smile at you, yeah, yeah. See, so I can do. I can do this. You can gurn, can't you? Yeah. You, I tell you what, you'd be a great gurner. Would I? Like? Would you gurn at this? Of course, it's coming back. Oh, they do. Just let me. Oh, what yeah, you mean for women? Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, I would wear one. Yeah. I mean, look at these birds here. Kinch perfect. 
Hourglass. They've all got hourglass figures. Mm. Mind you, I do think the corsets. This girl here. Um, don't give a name. Mm. Don't matter. Uh, it's called Brenda. Madra. Madra. What a funny name, isn't it? Madra. Madra's bra is um, 28 double E. Mm. It's a funny size, isn't it? 28 double E. Yeah. It's not like 34 double F, is it? But she don't look like a double E cup. She looks more like a B. I think she's telling pork, is there? Then you've got Regina. Have... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what a funny that we got. <laughs> oh, Vag. <laughs> oh, I said that on WM. I know you did. <laughs> I know you did, yeah. Uh, oh, I got told off a bit, but yeah. there you go. Yeah. She's got a 32E. Mm-hmm. How do they measure them? Yeah, oh, but what, what? I've never seen the thing that the measures cor- them, have you? The corsets make it pop up a bit, you know what I mean? It pushes it so, up. So, for instance, with Madra... Right, it's turned her into a 28 double E to a 28 GG. But you just, I'll tell you what, I'll show you that. That's her on the left. She mm. ain't got a bloody G cup there. Her over there. Oh, no. I was looking at those very I phone. know, they're I quite small, the, they are. I was looking at the phone tariffs. Anyhow, she's gone to like a 32 H vagina, vagina has. <laughs> 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 and Joanna. Thank God for that. <laughs> oh. jo- yeah, Joanna. She's her bust is. Um, she looks a bit like. Um, who's the bird that used to do the maths? Not Natalie Bennett. Carl Vorderman. Yeah. Imagine if Natalie Bennett was on. She ain't Down. looking too bad for her age. Is she? Carl Same age as us. Well, same as she. Didn't show you. Well, this bird looks like a twenty-seven-year-old Carol Vorderman. She goes from thirty-four C to a thirty-four double D. Don't know if Mecca, you know, no one are making a comeback. So is D bigger than a C? What? I don't know. I don't yeah, know these things. Yeah, I'm stupid. You've got a bra size. I haven't got any bra sizes. No, you, no. <laughs> you actually could wear one if you wanted to. Yeah. But you know a bra, right? Yeah. What do you think you go... You, you've heard... Of, you know the alphabet, don't you? Yeah. Right. So if you've got, say, a cup size... They go from A cups to, well, I suppose some of them go up to about M and M, don't they? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Tell you what, some right big ones about. But what would you think the bigger the size is? A is the smallest, B, C, D, yeah. E, so it gets bigger. I know now. So from a C cup, yeah. if it goes to a D cup, which these corsets are doing, yeah. it makes them bigger. Oh, uh, right. That's okay. what it's so all you're, about. Doing, you're doing your Les Dawson impression there, yeah. aren't you, with the old... Oh, he never liked Les Dawson in the corset, to be fair. No. Nah. Did like Les Dawson. I it was quite he funny. He was funny, wasn't Yeah, he's done the piano. I would never forget mm. that. Oh, I have. What did he do? Don't you remember, he, could, he could play any song. Could he really? On the piano. He's brilliant on the piano. Oh, was he really? Yeah, he was oh, actually okay. a fantastic... He was actually an accomplished pianist. Oh, right. But, um, you know, he could... He could yeah. Uh, do you like comedians? I like people that make me laugh. I do, yeah, yeah. It's in this bird shit, it makes me laugh. 24 grand a year from guinea pigs videos online. People will watch anything, won't they? She gets a little guinea pig. Alfie, Gizmo, Billy and the gang. And they have certain backstage requirements. It's a bit unfortunate if you're in the gang, you don't get a mention. No, no. Like, um, I know. Like, um, it's support like, actors, aren't they? Like, it's not like Derek and Derek's gang, any yeah, when he goes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you, you was Brian. there. Brian. Yeah. Brenda. Because you take him out for a walk every day, don't you, Derek? Yeah, mm. give him a walk. You got to win. Yeah. Yeah. And then he deposits, don't I? He does deposit, yes. Oh, <laughs> oh you're referring to my little accident. You know? Yeah. Those bags are a bit oh, flimsy, aren't they? they are. Well, I don't know, because I ain't got a dog. Put my finger right through it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, mate, how are you? Oh, no, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I didn't pick my nose for a fortnight. <laughs> but really, it really smells It, it well. usually does, it that does kind of stuff. Smells, yeah. yeah. It it's smell, amazing, yeah. really, isn't it? Couldn't find anything to wipe it on. The grass. <laughs> <laughs> the dog. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, Daddy. Can be back? Oh, God. where's a duck leaf when you need one? Exactly. Did you ever find that they stopped stinging? No. No, I never know that. No. But rubbish. still, we done it, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, we did, yeah. Didn't no, we? then going into... Um, I was not going to play Shakespeare now, neither, you know? Oh, um, oh what's day? a white D? White D? Oh, there's an orange dot now, is all it? Man? Yeah. The, next, the new one. I know, she's got an agent already, hasn't she? Yeah. yeah. Well, you've got to get one in place, haven't you? Yeah. 
I mean, like, what a waste of time, isn't it? Yeah. It's it is pathetic, isn't it? It is. I mean, and they, the, the, you see the media. I have had a, well, as you can see, I've had a media black boycott and blackout. Mm. But it didn't do no good. No, no. How long did that last? About a week. Yeah. And we do um, this show, like, every week, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so there wasn't really a... Well, I'd done a boycott <laughs> while we were off. <laughs> you saw that was Andy, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah, no. like that fell in. Look, if you're going to have a boycott sometime, do it when you ain't working. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Of course, yeah. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Hey! Have you noticed we've got another shirt up there? Oh, blimey up. Yeah, we got that signed at the um, Speedway uh, last that looks week. Good, don't for it? the um Is uh, it the same benev- signatures on there? No, it's for the um, it's it's the riders from both teams and management. Uh for the uh, benevolent fund for the riders. Oh well. There done. you go. Nice. Jay got that. He also got it very dirty in the middle. Uh, right. Do you know I was gonna say what do they do? Run over it. <sighs> it's a crummy kitty. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Flipping heck. Right. Hey. Okay, we're going to play some yeah, songs. Yeah, let's play songs. I want to go. I want to. Um... We're going to play back to back and then we can have a cup of tea then. Yeah, and I'm going to talk about them cans of Coke. All right, then, okay. See that bird with cans of Coke? No. We're going to talk about it in a minute. We're sort of making love to them, we're sure. Hey? Oh, no. Nothing to do with the trees then? No, 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 no. She, oh, no, so she, right. yeah, okay. she just drunk them. Okay. Okay, so after our advert, we're going to have um, Able Archer. And Ghostmaker and Little Illusion Machine. Do you know who was an able archer? No. Robin Hood. Yeah. Went riding through the Glen, didn't I? Yeah. Was it Robin Hood? Yeah, he did. With his merry men. Oh, yeah, yeah. it was, yeah. yeah and, his, and his friends, Little Bob and... Mind you, he never kind of quite cut it, did he? Friar, Friar Jones. What was his name, that American actor that was Robin Hood? Oh, yeah. Kevin Costner. Kevin Costner. Yeah. Didn't really work, did it? Robin sure Hood with an American accent. Sure in here. Yeah. Didn't work at all. Nah. Okay, so there you go. Are you going to press that bleeding button then? Sorry.
2000 Cleaning. We are an expanding family business with 20 years experience in the cleaning industry. If you are experiencing problems with your present cleaning arrangements, or even if you are not, and just require a one-off spring clean, we would be happy to offer a free quotation. Call us now on 0121 604 1047 or on mobile 07967 137783. Or go to our site, image2000cleaning.co.uk and fill in the contact form there. That was Little Illusion Machine, The Shining, preceded by Dublin's Able Archer, Ghostmaker, sent in by our friend. Have you got Kiss Kiss this week? Kiss, no Kiss Kiss. No Kiss Kiss. No Kiss. Emma. Kiss. Plug in, baby. 
if you're going to send Chris some tracks, will you please put a kiss on it? Or we won't play it. Well, we will. Yeah, we, we will, you yeah. just choose you up, down it. Yeah. As I say, she's probably looked at your profile. When you get to mate. my age, you know what I mean? Every little thing. Yeah. I oh, know. Literally. Yeah. Hey, did you see that programme, Paul Cannaville? No, I have no clue what you were talking about when you were posting He's got a book Facebook. out called Black and White. Right, okay. It's black and white, black and blue. He's a Chelsea player, and he was the first black Chelsea player. All right. Have a look, because we've got an online shop, haven't we? And yeah. we can, we're affiliates to Amazon. Mm-hmm. If, he saw, if he's selling his book through the Amazon, have a look at it. Yeah, right. Black and blue, Paul Cannaville. And it's like, put, you know how to spell Paul, don't you? Yeah. I've heard of Paul Cannaville, I remember it. Yeah, well, yeah. Just, yeah. just Google it and, sit yeah. and see it, and then we'll get on there. Yeah. But it was um, <clears throat> it was documentary kind of programme um, about him being the first black player of Chelsea Football Club and it was fantastic he he didn't do it he was just sitting there talking about his experiences and Pat Mm. Nevin was on what smashing bloke who comes across as Pat Nevin Pat Nevin Mm. yeah he he always was a bit outspoken yeah intelligent intelligent. I've always liked Pat Nevin and what a great player as well Pat Nevin was he may have worked on the union side of um, players association I I think he did did, to be quite honest with you but um, and Paul Cannaville was I miss the beginning bit of it, and I'm going to get it again on on demand and catch up. Mm. But I, it riveted me. Few things rivet me. This riveted me, and he was talking about his experience as a professional footballer, and I could relate to that. Not that I've been a professional footballer, but you know you're playing, and and he was he was on the bench this day, and he's looking over to the boss. You know, and so what era are we talking about? It was the early eighties. Oh, early eighties. Early eighties. Oh, right, okay. right. Early eighties. Early eighties. It was. So it was that long before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking maybe it was like pre. No. Sort of Clyde Best, West Ham. No. So, no. 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 Oh, Albert no. Johansson didn't he played for Leeds in the sixties. Clyde yeah. Best played for West Ham. Seventies. Yeah. And there wasn't there wasn't many black players playing in English football in them da- in those no. days. I think uh, there was one just after the war, wasn't there? Quite a famous. Um, famous Arthur Wharton tra- is the, the the most yeah. famous one. His name was the Leeds, first. Was it or something? Like, was it, I can't um, remember. Or Huddersfield, I think it was. Like yeah. But um, anyhow, Dixie Dixie Dean. I reckon Dixie Dean was was had got some no. black root. Yeah, somebody called him something. When then Dixie Dean panned him. <laughs> right. Oh God! Oh, yeah. <laughs> and um, so you know this poor cannibal, and he's telling the story and looking over at the boss and looking at this fullback and thinking, I've got the running on him, I can beat him. And he's literally chomping on the bit. And, do you know, the, he was telling such a great story. Even I thought that I could get on that pitch and beat that <laughs> Crystal Palace fullback. Yeah. And, and I was excited. I'm going, look, what's going on next? And you don't normally so, get excited. No, nah, well, I do sometimes, especially with football and music. And he said, so I got the nod. I got the nod. And mm. there he is. He's in the zone. He's making his debut for Chelsea football. He's in the zone, mm. coming on, getting warming up, stretching. So he's running down the line, getting ready to go on and score a goal as mm. a professional footballer. That's what you're born to do, isn't it? Everything he's ever done, he's born. This is the mo. This is his moment. So he said, my back was towards the crowd. He said, the racial abuse I got was terrible. From his own supporters. Said, well, that's it, yeah. He said. And as he was talking, he said, I thought, OK, your away game is at Crystal Palace. He said, I turned around, it's my own fans. Mm. And then he, he said, you know, I just, I just wanted to get off the pitch. I got on the pitch, mm. booing the booing me, that hating me. He even went on when he said he scored two goals um, against um, Sheffield Wednesday when Chelsea were being mullered at half-time. And he, he changed the game. I think he come on in the second half or something. Completely changed it. Got man of the match. Scored two goals. And Chelsea fans were saying, well, we kind of lost 4-2 because the black bloke scored two of our goals. Mm. You know, you're looking and you're just sitting there listening. I'm, you're, you're almost in tears. Mm. Thinking. And But if you look at that at Birmingham City in the 80s, and I started thinking that to like the Blues. You know, probably the first black player at Birmingham, which they would be Noel. Noel Blake, yeah. Yeah. You know, I mean, I'm trying to wrap my brains 
you know, black players before? No. Trend the 80s time, mm-hmm. we had a few. You Must know. Must have been no, yeah. But I'd say, I mean, Noel Blake was loved yeah. at Birmingham. Oh, crikey, like, yeah. Noel Blake was a hero. He was a, yeah, yeah. You know, Noel Blake, but again, and, and I... You know, if that would have been a northern club, I would, I might have thought, you know, you know, sometimes with a north south divide. Mm. But being in London, mm. you know, certainly in Birmingham, growing up in Birmingham, it's like, it's, you know, all the colours of a rainbow in Birmingham. Of course, yeah, yeah. And on Blake, no Blake, no Blake, no Blake, no Blake, no Blake. No Blake. I mean, Blake, he was the original Zulu warrior, wasn't he? He was, yeah. Do you remember, yeah. like, because the Tilton Road end was closed in them days, yes, wasn't it? Right, because yeah, of crowd yeah, disturbances. Yeah. But yeah. us in the cup, we used to be in the cup. Zulu, Zulu, warrior, Zulu, and Blakey had just like put yeah. his fist up to the cup, wouldn't they? Yeah. You know, and you look at that and you just think, how can in the same era, the same like season, it would never have crossed our mind. No, I don't think no, not it? at no. all. No. But like he said, he played at Villa. Mark Walters played for the Villa. Mm. He said, Mark, he said, Mark, come. He said, I've never had nothing like it. Mm. You know, I get it on the away games, but like your own fans. That's mad. Just outrageous. Mm. So, and and again, not that long ago, mate. Yeah. Not that long ago. Terrible how how some people can be so despicable towards others. Flesh, blood. So they got a different colour. Mm. So they got a different religion. Same blood. So they got different political beliefs. Same blood. You're all the one, and yeah, you're uh, all one. Yeah, yeah. Because you say Noel Blake was a great thing, isn't he? Blake is with well. he's with the um, England youth, isn't he? Or something. Oh, that or nineteen? Under nineteen? Yeah, he's doing well. Blake has done a great. You say even like because Blake he started his career at the Villa. Mm. He used to wear the blue stuff under his Villa top. Blake eh? was he used to wear Hoppy did Hoppy did the same, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. And Villa yeah. fans caught him when I took a corner at Notts County. <laughs> Yeah, but again, as I say, people uh, sometimes, you know, sometimes you watch something and uh, you're shocked. Mm. That programme shocked me. Mm. Yeah. But there you go. Anyhow, come on. What have we got on next? Okay, we're going to have one of your favourites here. We're going to have... Uh, typical uh, Muggsy English sent in. Uh, the get-go's? Yeah. Muggsy sent this in. Oh, right. okay. These are a brilliant, one of my favourite bands, the get-go. Okay. Good stuff. Typically, here you go. Typically English.
From South London, y'all. How come we didn't get Biscuit Airways up in the air this week? Oh, the plane's in for the service. Oh, is it? Yeah, cool? yeah, yeah. Sorry. We have to service it every now and then. It's a clean and when, it yeah, it does. Down the back I know. Old, uh, what's it been? Yeah, I know. But um, no, like all things need servicing, and mm. you you have to think about health and safety. So mm. when this is quite a, it's quite a big airplane, you know. It's getting bigger. So I took it down to Birmingham Airport, and mm. they're doing the once over, but it will be back. For next week, I thought I'll just do it while your missus is off, mm. and we hadn't done Good the idea. biscuit boys. Good idea, you know. Push it through a car wash. Well, they've they've just got a big they've got a big thing down there, the big unit sitting there, Birmingham Airport. Mm. It is like a car wash, but a plane don't fit you. I mean, I was going to take oh, it down the yeah, Coventry Road. Right, yeah. You know what I mean? But um, they said it wouldn't be a problem, but I'd have to take the wings off. Oh, I thought I can't be asked. That. Yeah, Typical English. Brilliant. Down in twelve cans of fizzy drinks and twenty-four bags of crisps a day. Do you think that's typical English? How many crisps? Twenty-four bags of crisps a day. Self-confessed fizzy pop addict who was heading for a heart attack. To be honest, I, I would say she's heading more for diabetes. Yeah. Wouldn't you? Oh god, yeah. For an heart attack. Mm. I mean, how can you lie? Like? Don't she cook? I mean, I eat bags of crisps. Yeah, that's only... cooks, but that's why I eat Good bags cook, of crisps. Yeah, yeah. What are you laughing at? I think he'll kill you when she catch up with you. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you give her, you give her the tips about ironing the yeah, other way. Cooking. You give her the cookery tips. Oh, sure, I had to do rice thing. I did rice thing last night. And when you was on the phone, when you was on the phone to me she that day, she, she was hanging out the bathroom window. Yeah. I tell you what, if she if she could have got the phone off me mm. and then put her hands down the phone, grabbed you by the throat, she'd have done that. Yeah, mm. yeah. she can be quite aggressive. I, I, Not as bad yeah. as the last one, though. No, 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 no. I, yeah. I gathered that. Yeah, mm. yeah. I'll try and think up some more tips for her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep her happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll yeah. I'll pass them the on. Washing, cooking, ironing. Does she know how to do the ironing properly? Yeah. yeah, she's pretty good at ironing. Is she? Yeah. Oh, don't know. Looking at your clothes. <laughs> I iron my clothes. Don't yeah. you iron your oh, you clothes? Oh, you had to iron your clothes, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. You've got some <laughs> big mouth. I oh, just wear clothes that don't need ironing. Don't you ever iron your clothes? I don't need to iron. Clothes? Like what? Like you don't everything? Iron, you don't iron jeans? Of course you iron jeans. You don't iron jeans. You iron jeans. Why? Because you're wearing them out. You wear you everything you wear, you iron. Can you tell that these haven't been ironed? <laughs> exactly. Not with you. There's work stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm, you know what I mean? I'm on my hands with these, with these. And it looks as though you yeah. have been and all. So, yeah. ironing jeans. I bet you put a pleat down the middle of that as well. stupid. You get the what? You know where the seam is there, yeah. like that? And you do that. And then you just iron them. You have to. God, there's no point. Mm. You, not really you do and roll, are you? You do wash them. I'm, I'm getting, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Every year. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> are you talking about years? Mm. Richard the Third. 500 yeah. years, he's been dead. He's they just dead. him. He's dead. I know. He was a right. Yeah. Car park the third. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> <laughs> We've had an invasion. Have we? Have what? Elephants. 
you know, they've been there. They've been there for three shows. You're, the, first, you're the first person who's noticed them. Really? Yeah. 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 Apparently, they're supposed to bring you good luck. They're Indian elephants, aren't they? How do you know that? Because they're a good, good wide. They're. They've only got little they're ears. Like in, they? They're like Hindu. They're like Hindu things, they've got aren't different they? Different ears. African and Indian elephants have got different types of ears. Small and big. That they have. I done um, a piece of homework with my daughter the other week. We had oh. to write a poem about elephants. Yeah. And um, I said, what we need to do is get some fantastic facts. So she said, Dad, I'll Google it. So she's gone on a computer, Googled it. They do, and they um, the tusks as well. I think it's the Asian elephants. There's Asian elephants and African elephants. Only the Asian male elephants have tusks. Mm. And they, they, do you know what the tusks for? (sighs) Foraging for food. And that's what they have the tusks for and stuff like that. Yeah. So giraffes don't have that problem. They've just got big necks. Mm. And they just eat the leaves from the trees. But I, I looked at the elephant. It marvels me with big animals. Does it not you? Mm. Food-wise, I That's think, what I'm saying. Yeah. How do they get enough food exactly. all day? Exactly. How can you have an elephant just living on leaves and branches? Mm. Surely they must need meat. They're yeah. anemic. Mind you, I don't suppose you could tell with the colour they're grey, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. They're already grey. But I wonder if like, they think, oh, God, I'm sick of this. Yeah. I fancy a burger. Exactly. It must be boring, mustn't it? Mm. In life. Oh, we are. Look, I found another tree with a leaf. My well, bird's shagging at the moment. Wait for she finished. Yeah. No, no. Must be boring being an, an animal. Mm. What animal would you be if you could be one? Uh, what I mean, if I could be one, if yeah. I had to be one, you mean? Yeah, if you'd like um, come back as one. Well, I'm trying to think of one that will survive by killing everything else. Probably a lion. Would you like to be a lion? Yeah. Yeah, king. I'm king of the jungle. jungle. <laughs> yeah, I'd like yeah. to be a lion. Yeah. What about you? I've never really thought about it before, but I think I'd be... Um, I'd Not be a monkey. Cheeky monkey. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, I'll be a monkey. I guess you're going to yeah. be a monkey, yeah. yeah it fit yeah. my character. I'd be a monkey and I'd take yeah. the piss. Yeah. I'd just swing from trees just to annoy you. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, big bollocks. <laughs> yeah. I've noticed a lot of monkeys play with themselves as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I never told you about that. Yeah, you oh. can't probably do my cat story. No, I don't think you're not, 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 this, not this week. Maybe. I can write it. Yeah. But I can't really broadcast it. It's no, a bit no, vulgar. No, no. Yeah, it is. Is really the word like. vag in it? No, it's. Mm. He was like an ejaculating cat. Oh right, okay, but it's natural. I oh, know. Well, I've. I'll call him the ejaculating cat. Of, okay. I'll come into work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I did. The one, I mean, my customer. She's like, she, she's she's. In all deadly serious, this like now. You got this, uh, oh, right? He won an ejaculating cat. It's a squirrel. <laughs> right, it was an ejaculating squirrel of most. Same like. thing. It is, yeah. Yeah. But Didier's got a cat, mm. right? And like, you know, he looked, did he? Yeah, yeah, did he? Yeah, did he? Yeah. And this squirrel, right? He likes to go and get the nuts. She's got a nut feeder. Yeah. Right, right outside the house. It's a long story. No, no, I'll cut, I'll cut it okay. short. And she was like, she said, the ejaculation squirrel of Mosley's dead. I thought, I ain't got a clue who it is. The girls that work for her have been trying to get it on a YouTube. Because what it does, this squirrel, it eats the nuts, turns round and pulls one off in front of like this big window yeah. of me customer. Oh, yeah, it's oh, really peculiar. Oh. Anyhow, so, and what it does, it literally, the way that it kind of perches itself, it, 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 it holds one hand on the kind of, it's like a fence, but you know, like these kind of, not a trellising fence, but a wire fence. Yes. Do you know what I, I mean? I mean, yeah, on, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. So on the railway embankments. Mm-hmm. So he puts his one hand over so he makes sure he doesn't fall. He's eating the nuts and then he gets the old what's it and starts, you mm-hmm, know, mm-hmm, knocking mm-hmm, one off. Yeah. Well, anyhow, he wasn't looking, was he, what was going on? Well, Didier's cat's a monster. And Didier's cat had him for breakfast. Oh, did Literally, he? yeah. Oh, no. I know, uh, oh. Yeah, I said, it's the more customer. never seen him coming. 
But that was the end of the ejaculating cat, uh, ejaculating squirrel of Mosley. Shame. I know. Uh, he was going to be a, a YouTube bit as well. Mm. I'll tell you what, I bet he'd have got a million. <laughs> so, yeah, I'd be a monkey. Yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, okay. We're going to play some music now. Are we? We're going to yeah. play some... Should we play two back-to-back? We're going to play, we're going to play back-to-back. The first Who one we is... Uh, we're going to have the Strangler Figs. What a great name. Hey, when's the uh, Puppet Rebellion? Yeah, when's that show coming out? That's going to be out, hopefully... Yeah. Tonight or tomorrow? Last night. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So okay. Brilliant one, Ah, oh, fantastic. Did I get it out last night? Yeah, you did. On time. Yeah, oh, you were quality. Okay. Yeah. Did you well. Did, you had a good eye, Yeah. yeah. Oh, P-P-I. P-P-I. What are you wearing? We haven't had people. What are you wearing gloves for in the uh, studio? Because it was cold, and now I can't be bothered to get take them off. What goes coldest on your body? My hands. Do they really? Yeah, I think I got. I got. It's my knuckles. I think they start to get arthritic. My feet get coldest. Yeah. I've always had cold feet. My mm. missus, it's a nose. Yeah, my nose gets cold as well now. I told her only dogs have cold nose. Cold nose, mm. healthy body though. Sorry. They do with a dog. Yeah. I did tell her that, and she, you know, oh, yeah, didn't get over it. Like. That. No, oh. no. Right, come on, then. Let's have back to back then. Okay, Strangler Figs and Zen Judaism. That's a mouthful, isn't it? Brilliant. This is Ron Atkinson, and you're listening to Sports Radio. Be wise, my friend. Sell your skin, rule the streets of men One thousand years, their sovereignty's your flowery bed You'll sink the city of Angkor Wat You're the curse the gods coerce through power and lust The monkey king sees everything his claws can touch Then we'll need your face Your sight of shit, delight of sensual taste Then tear me up inside and break me down It's clear they're quite sensitive, it freaks me out And yet still, I could feel no more fear Now, wait, I said I really don't know Something about you shifting in time Cosmic symmetry strokes the sky Compulsion winter shivers down my spine But it's like a life with a vine How's the wind on a beam on the ride? Flowers burst and bloom and die Optics and many blows my mind And I feel you no more fear Now when I said I really don't know
there you go. So be- before you exp- uh, tell us about those two tracks and just say how easy it is to send yeah, us please, can music, you? because somebody has just sent us a track. Eek. Um, eek. Uh, uh, there's two ways of sending us music. Easiest way is probably tracks at sportsradio.co.uk. Yes, yeah, yeah, definitely. But if you do that, please attach some sort of bio. Yeah, and if you're well, all bio, world band pictures. Pictures would mm. be nice. Pictures mm. would be nice. But uh, a bio and, and, and bits and pieces yeah, would be yeah. great, yeah. Or you can just go to our site, uh, srbradio.com, and upload from there. Because people do send us tracks, and we've no idea who they are. We haven't got a clue. Oh, well. We haven't got a Scooby-Doo. We play them, yeah. but, but we don't know who they are. Yeah. We go, like, you sent it, we like it, we play it. Yeah. And even if we don't like it, we play it. That's right. Don't we? Yeah. yeah. We're not prejudiced. Yeah. We ask you to send us your tracks. We play them. Mm-hmm. Anyhow, that was uh, Zen Judaism. Mm-hmm. Private bank, so cold. Really? And it's out on the 23rd of March, which is... Uh, yesterday, going, yesterday, I think. Yeah. Yesterday, Monday, yeah. That's how new it is. Uh-huh. Do you know? And also, Bones, a picture of you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, I on, man. It's all about Bones again, isn't it? Pardon? It's all uh, about, yeah. oh, about a squirrel. <laughs> we could be on about the squirrel, the bird Anything. with the tree, yeah. King Richard the Third. Multilingual. Yeah, two nephews, you know. Never seen them again. No, Sent them to the tower. Never saw it again. They used to do that a lot, didn't they? You know. And there's a kiss. It's Emma Kiss. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So it's a new single from Zen Judaism, and it's out. Um, preceded by. The Stranger Figs, and they're from Leicester. Uh, she's had a good weekend as well, Emma. Recovering. It's not the Stranger Figs, by the way. You can't read, can you? You haven't. Stranger. No, I've put a pair of glasses over there. Oh, God. And I put them. I thought, oh, Gabby can have them glasses. Can I have them to keep? Yeah, because they're proper, like, you can see through, you can oh, read with them. Brilliant. I thought I'll give them to him. I'm going to, like, clean them a bit. Yeah, I would, yeah, because oh. I've spat on them as well, haven't I? Conjunctivitis from that. Yeah. Can't Geordie say conjunctivitis? Why are you Shella Cool. Hello there, my <laughs> name's Shella Cool. It's almost like worth having conjunctivitis if you're a Geordie. Why, the I? Any. I Where got, you go? That's a cracker. I got conjunctivitis. <laughs> Me and the rest of the band leak. Yeah. It's like, you know, when you've got a cold and you've got to have a, like, a spray of Vicks or just put yeah. Vicks on you. What? It's worth having a cold every now and then just so you can have a, a squat of, like, Vicks on your uh, on your bed. You know, your, your gym How jams. How did we get onto that from Geordie's? Whoa. Conjunctive oh, voices. Oh, oh, yeah. Do you know, these glasses are brilliant. Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. Uh, look at Lester's Strangler Figs. It's so much clearer, you know, when glasses when you've got do glasses. That. Yeah, yeah, they do that. Know, yeah. yeah, she's been roller skating with the daughter. she got a bruise bum. Oh, yeah. right, okay. So I'm guessing that she's probably not the best roller skater. No. Have you ever been roller skating? Yeah, oh, we used Did to you? go Saturday mornings. They used to go Saturday mornings. Roller skating, though, or ice skating, I, what I'm saying. I roller skating uptown. Did you really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, wasn't very good at it. No. Tried, tried ice skating, wasn't very good at it. Mm. I'm not very good at things, actually. Roller skating is slightly better, isn't it? It's, yeah, easier, you mean. Well, if you put your hands down, you're roller skating, someone goes over your skating yep, knacker, don't you? Yep, yep, yep. A bit boring, though, isn't it? You just go round and round. I don't get it. And round. I've never... Fall rolled. over. Yeah. Round. I've never Fall skated over. in my life. Wow. Never. I just don't... I don't... Do you know? I don't see the point. No, I wouldn't want to see you roller skating. Either. But then again, people would say, it's like with running. Mm-hmm. Why'd you run round a track? Why'd you run round... You're only going round and round and round. Yeah, but that's competitive, isn't it? Well, roller skater is kind of like... No, not really. My nah, tent isn't really. <laughs> trying to talk up the roller skaters and yeah, the ice skaters. Yeah, working. Uh, no. working. But I suppose they use it to do stuff, you know, like um, playing ice hockey. Yeah. You need to skate to play ice hockey. Right. Yeah. Are you okay there? I'm okay, yeah. I'm just thinking we've got 20, 29 minutes left oh, and we've got about God, 40, 40 oh, no, minutes we, of songs. Oh, God, grief. Well, let's just go into our... Um, Agony Uncles. Besotted by fit guy I spied in a shower. I looked at that and I thought, blimey, okay. I go to the gym every night just to bump into another guy there. Okay, yeah. Get this next bit. I split up with my girlfriend three months ago. Are you getting where it's coming from? Mm Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. No. No, okay. I'll read on. We both realised the relationship had run its course. 
I'm a 27 year old man and I've only ever been in straight relationships. I have experimented with men but never became involved with any of them. I see a guy regularly at my gym. He's about the same age as me and he's very fit. We have never really spoken apart from the odd hi and now I have a big crush on him. I saw him naked in the showers and it blew my mind. I bet it wasn't the only thing you wanted to blow. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. I just have a very strange vision when somebody says I've experimented with men. Yeah. I just think of the lab. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't stop thinking about him and every time I go to the gym I'm hoping to see him there. What's your advice? He's got a crush. He's well, got a man crush. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't, do, do, does he really need my advice? I mean... Well, he's asked you know. Deirdre, so I suppose he wants some. He's got to go where your heart is. See, Deirdre has suggested, get talking to the guy. I think he's a good starter. Yeah. Suggest a drink or a coffee so that you can get to know him. And ask whether he's single. Ask whether he is free. But I think this is the most important question. You've got to try and ascertain whether he's straight or he's gay. Mm. Or he's a bit of both, you see. Yeah. And, you know, don't expect too much. Because, you know, don't just come out with it. I'd drop... <laughs> I'd ju- if I was him, I'd just drop the odd subtle hint. Pardon? <laughs> you know, just ask him his taste in music for, you know... <laughs> <laughs> it's going like, down it? Be like Stephen. Do you mm. like books fees? Oh right. Yeah. And stuff like that. Mm-hmm. You know, and just kind of just general questions because you know, if if he's not gay and he doesn't fancy her, I think this bloke could get a little bit upset. So I just play it gently, really. You know. That'd be my best bit of advice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah great stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it, no, but seriously, it is a delicate one, isn't it? It is. You know, yeah. if you if you fancy Probably a bloke delicate. you're in the shower, mm. you know, you, 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 I mean, I'd ask him where he goes for a drink as well. I mean, like you know, if he, <laughs> <laughs> if he goes to certain bars, you know that he's in with half a chance, don't you? Yeah, yeah. You yeah. Know. Who's Arthur? <laughs> <laughs> he's in somebody else as well. Seminage <laughs> oh, de- I wouldn't suggest a Seminage first. Yeah. <laughs> you got yeah. him say. What is a Seminage I mean, you thought it was a vegetable, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> is that one of your five a day? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I'm gonna pass on. <laughs>
Yeah, it makes it look bigger as well. Yeah, yeah. It could look quite intelligent. These are, my, glasses on. these are my first pair of glasses. Yeah. Do you know, everything seems much clearer. It's just amazing, isn't it? I know. I can actually, I can look at this now, and it looks as though it's in a new dimension. Mm. I can, you know, when, like, you were a kid, yeah. and you can, like, see your, your writing. Yeah. Words. Yeah, I know. But i tell you what, when I take them off, yeah. it makes a difference as well. Yeah, yeah. Can't yeah. see it as good. No, you need different glasses for that. I'm all right seeing things further away. Mm. I mean, I was all right seeing the sun. Yeah. 93 million miles away from me. I was going to be that I bad. I see it every day. Yeah, pay street. Yeah, which it's isn't that, which isn't they? pay through anymore. They have I, something else on pay street. Let's have a look. Oh, we are old. Um, the Argentinians are getting a bit frisky, aren't they? Over the old uh, Falklands. Putin. Yeah, Putin's giving them a bit of a. Oh, we are. What, why do the Russians want want Blimey. Falklands? They've always what? wanted the Falklands. Aren't why? They? What are they going to do with it? Don't know. Why do people want islands? They, they, there's always a strategic reason for an invasion. Well, yeah, usually involves an invasion, don't it? Yeah. Do or, yeah. you know, a dropping off point so they can bomb the shit out of some poor bastard. Mm. Generally speaking, they have a lump of rock for. So like Gibraltar, what's the point? That's only full of monkeys. Yeah, yeah. There's yeah. nothing there at Gibraltar, is there, apart from a cafe at the top of the mountain? Well, it's the gateway to the um, Mediterranean. That's what I'm saying, That's yeah. why. It's strategic, isn't it? That's so, all it is. That's strategic. what I'm saying with a block of, like, you know, rock. Mm. It's usually for a strategic thing, not that... Right, mm. page three, they don't have page three. Hey, isn't that funny in the sun today? What? <laughs> Look at the page three there. They've got it the wrong way up. What's that? I don't know, it's your no. phone or mine. That's not mine. Look at it. That's a misprint, isn't it? It's the wrong way up. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know why? I look, don't. look at it closely. Look at that number three. Oh, it looks like your boobs, don't it? They tell you what, they're ever so subtle. It's probably always like that. It's probably always been like Probably that. is. Mm. <coughs> it's cleavage week in the sun. That's why. Do you like cleavage? I couldn't eat a whole one. Yeah, you'd try that, wouldn't you? Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can beat a bit of cleavage. No. Nah. Can you? Really? No. Nah. You know, if somebody said to you, you know, kind of the backside or the boobs. What would you rather, a backside or boob? <sighs> top or bottom? I think probably top. Oh, I would all day yeah, long as well. All day, all yeah. day long. Yeah. 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 Come on then. So let's um, let's. What we got on next? Okay, we're gonna have another another track that we haven't alphabet played as well. Alphabet backwards. Can you do the alphabet backwards? Z. What comes next? Y. X. Hold on. That's as let's far see. As I can go. Z Z Y X A B C D F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X X Y Z Yeah X Y So you went Z What yeah you done well There you go Yeah you're brilliant you are Can you still speak French? We Yeah but what's your what's your favourite saying in French? I love that We No I love the one about your goldfish Oh the poisson rouge à l'ouvre fenêtre Oh Your goldfish opens the window You're gonaius I should add it on the end of that um, yeah. oh, do you know when you're dead, mm. Lois? If I go after you, I'm gonna have that on your grave. You won't go after me. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, this is a uh, fingertips by alf- alphabet backwards, or it's alphabet backwards by fingertips. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. 
Out on the 30th of May, Alphabet Backwards, all the way from Oxford, sent in by M. And we've got a we've got a little Twitter feed there as well at Alphabet Backwards. Ah, it's brilliant, brilliant. Fantastic. fantastic. Do you like that? Yeah, I like it. Yeah, it's quite oh, summery, wasn't it? Yeah. Do you know it was, wasn't it? The sun came out as well. Yeah, and it, spring is going to be summery as well. Easter is going to be 20 degrees. Is it? Yeah. Who said that? Going to be hot tubs and everything out. So I tell you what. I'm, Easter. No, no, but somebody else might have one. You. People look. No, I ain't got one um, either. But some of the people have. I don't know anyone that's got one. No, no me, no me. But all over the road have got one. Oh, have they? And they had to have it delivered by crane. Yeah, sometimes they do. Yeah, yeah. Could, I'd like one. I would. You yeah. see, one of them think you can't get it through your front door, can you? No, no. That's your problem, isn't it? Yeah. And yeah. an hot tub, you can't really take it to pieces and then build it in the back garden like uh, you do at Ikea, yeah. can you? Why your big kid do one where you blow it up? Do they? Yeah. Inflatable one? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Isn't that called a paddling pool? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But no, we, perhaps we could do um, a Biscuit Boys outside OB. Actually, We're doing OB from yeah. Yeah. his house. Yeah. Go knock on it. Do you know him? Got me do it from Jimmy's house. Yeah, you might. Do you know him? I don't know, no. You don't? No, no. Good way of finding out who he is. it's strange? It's, it's funny, isn't it? You don't know your neighbours these days. Nah. You were years ago. Mind you, you live on a big road. Yeah. I know all my neighbours. Yeah. I only live on a small road. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. And we're, I'm more sociable than you. Mm. Yeah, I'm true. guessing you, because you, you are, ain't you? But you're not yeah. that kind of... Mm, yeah, I am. I am sociable. All right, I, what's I've... his name next door? His name <laughs> is Lee. <laughs> Not Bruce Lee. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Yeah. Lee or Lee Lee? Lee. I don't know his second name is, I ain't got a clear. Oh, he's, he's seriously, he's his name yeah, yeah, Lee. Yeah, it is, his name's yeah, Lee. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Lee and Lou? Lee and Lou? Yeah. All oh, right. Lee and Lou. Yeah. Lee and Lou. Who's him next door? <sighs> yeah, you don't, do you? So I, do, I know, I, I do. I do. I know him very well, but I just can't think of his name. No, no. Yeah, okay. All right then, moving on. Okay. What we got now? Right then. Oh, I'll tell you what. Guess mm. next week in the show. Sound oh, check. Oh, yes, of course. Yeah. Yep. yeah we've got check. Nick and we've got Rihanna. From? Rhiannon. From? From. Sound check, I've just said. I know the show's called Sound check, but who? Big Centre TV. Our friends. Our friends. Great show. You've been keeping up with Sound check. I've, I have I love the, the one, star. I've heard the one song. Yeah. One, one show. One song. Yeah, I'll give you same for, yeah, this is when the Sound check starts. Wake up, Nick! Nick, wake up! Fuck you now, what's going on here? We've got a show. Who's Nick? Nick's a presenter, you donut! Why do and then Rhiannon. Because they have different starts to every show. I love the way they start the show. Oh, Rhiannon, yeah. right, a car broke down. Yeah. We've all been there. Yeah, yeah. You've got to go somewhere. I've got a bloody radio show to do. My car's broke down. Nick, any chance? And then he dressed up as Super Nick. 
He'd come and go oh, and then start it. Brilliant. God. So did, it's good did ice. Did you have to put his pants on outside his trousers? No, I don't think he did, no. No, I would have. Yeah. I would have. Mm. Just because I like doing it. Well, why not? Well, if you can get away with it, do it. Yeah, some of us, some of us can. Yeah. Well, you've still got the body to do that, haven't you? Mind you, that, there were hey. boyfriends last time I did it. So mm. It didn't work. Twitter time. Let's have a look. Let's give a shout out to our Twitter. Come on. Have we, we got time to... for Twitter time? We have time. to, yeah. They're... We have to. They're our listeners. You'll have to paddle in. Eh? Hey? You'll have to paddle Ain't you ready? No. Well, you know, honestly. Right then, Twitter's You're following so followers, followers. We, we have got, no? got 50 million trillion. Oh, yeah. Thank you. There you go. We've got... Uh, Vengard what? Hansen. Yeah. Go on, follow him. Put me in the box. I'm in wherever. Mm-hmm. Um... Am I? MC, MC, yeah. George, George Wilson. Wilson. Go on. Uh, number, no Disco. Yeah. Oh, what a great name. That is Class Side, our friends, Class Side. EGH Radio, well, our friends as well. Yeah, and yeah. they're all our friends. Yeah, yeah, How yeah. How come yeah. you're following them and that it's not come follow up? Uh, oh, we've, have we reached the limit? Yeah, we have. <gasps> yeah, that's why. Oh, right. So yeah. you're following too many. Yeah. So what we're you're going to have to do is go through them. Mm. All the ones ain't following us, just ignore them. Bug them okay. Off. They got to jog on, yeah, yeah, because yeah, we yeah, need to start yeah. following all these people. Okay, yeah, some good ones. There. Yeah, Lady Lake music. Yeah, we need screaming some. keys yeah. as well. I've heard yeah. a lot about okay. them. Mm-hmm. Lady Lake music. Has Lady Lake sent you any uh, stuff in no. by the way? Oh. It will be coming very, very soon. Good. Gavin Monaghan, Ben Banner, feed your elf, feed your elf. Rolls off the tongue. That does, don't it? Does yeah. yeah. Right, come on then. Back to music. What we got next? I'm loving this show today. Okay, we're going to so have... So much rocky oh, stuff. Some great stuff, mm. yeah. Uh, we're going to have... Um, we're going to have a quick back-to-back, actually. Oh, chasing, chasing Ghosts and Flecky Pets. Brilliant night. What's the point, though? Everything changes.
world up in Houston, world up in Vegas, world up in Boozy world. I'm like, damn, you ain't even knew the world's like, you could be my exclusive girl. Like, I a hearty heart. If you know about me, I like to party hard. Every year I be up in Mardi Gras. First time I came soft, I had to raise the bar. Yo, bitch, I had to make a classic. Come on, pass this. It's better than your lashes. I can connect you with the X of the box. I got the game on my hands, got the game on lock. Call it one, just call so she need me. Call it two, so I get too much fee-fees. Call it three, I was blows on my phone, but it ain't actuality. She really don't need me. Call it four's a girl I keep online. She says she needs me all times. Says she looking for a lover. And a lover like me is hard to find. Straight out of God, I'm Mr. Lover. lover. You could call me all night. Said you're looking for me, Mr. Lover. Looking for someone to talk to, Mr. Two Lover, Two completely Lover, different Lover. genres there. Yeah, That's all right, that. Yeah. American, uh, 21-year-old American singer-songwriter. Okay. Wrote mostly pop. My rap stage name is Young Stash. Yeah. That is the right one I'm reading, isn't it? It That's is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like. And yeah. we were bopping along to that. It was, yeah, but where's it say Mr. Lover on it? Don't... I think it's just one of the... Oh, got you there. It is Mr. Lover, the second one. There's three yeah. that he, so- he sent in. Yeah, so what you need to do is download them all. Yep. Get them in the system, put mm-hmm. them on my side. I'll tell you what, I like that, Mr. Love, that young stash. Like it, all the way from the US of A. And the other words, chasing ghosts. Have you yep. ever chased a ghost? How can you chase a ghost? I don't know, you can't see him, can nah, you? Nah, you got no chance. Hey, be be great though, wouldn't he? What are you doing? Chasing a ghost. It's like me going for an having an haircut, isn't it? Yeah, mm. pointless. Yeah, exactly. Come on. What we got? Oh, Fleck Pets we're going to play next. We're going to play Flecky Pets. Now's your oh, chance. Oh, no, it's not. It's Flecked Pets. Flecked. You haven't got your glasses on, have you? That's why you can't oh, see. No. Now's your chance. <laughs> Oh, 
Now was your chance by Flecked Pets. Have you ever had a Flecked Pet? No. No, I no, no. What, what's it like with gravy? I've never had a pet with gravy. Yeah. Yeah. What do you like with gravy? I like gravy. Do you like gravy? I love gravy. Mm. I love gravy. I like making a nice, really thick yeah. gravy. And then thin th- gravy, you can't have thin crusty gravy. Crusty bread dumped in gravy afterwards. Oh, you can't beach you, can you? And dump no. things and dump in the big, thick bread in there. Yeah, I love a dumpling. You get it all around your mouth, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, I love a ball tea. Yeah, I will love a ball tea. I had a ball tea the weekend. Yeah, oh, you can't beat a ball tea. Yeah. You can't, can you? No. Yeah. yeah. So, how's your phone, anyhow? Phone's great. As I was saying to you, it, um, it's got a fast charger. I just looked at mine. Mine ain't charging. No, no, it don't work on yours. No, my, cha- my, my phone in your kitchen ain't charging. Are you using my charger? Yeah. No. Yeah, I'm using your charger. Oh, right, okay. That's probably good, because you've got too many things running in the background. You know what it was? What? I forgot to put the plug down. Oh, right, yeah, 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 yeah. It does, does help. I know. It does help. You Putting put an electric down, current yeah. through an electric yeah. appliance uh, makes all the difference. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it funny, the way you get some plug sockets that you put a plug in a socket? You know the ones that haven't got the thing that goes up and down? Yeah. What's the point of having a thingy that goes up and down? You know, a switch? Yeah. You can put... Say you've got a plug. Mm. You clean, don't you? Yeah. You put a plug into the plug socket mm. in house and you vacuum straight away. But some plug sockets have got the switch. Yeah. That unless you put the switch down, it don't work. Mad, isn't it? So, does that mean when the switch is up, there's no electricity going through to... <laughs> so, are you safer? What I'm saying is, are you safer of a night when you've got a plug switch, turning the plug switch off? <laughs> Sorry, <Yeah. laughs> I've just fell asleep. For the <laughs> Come on, let's get some music. Up. All right, let's rock. Yeah.
do 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 dark stairs and hypnotize yeah oh give me sorry, the dark stairs give me the dark, dark stairs stair. go on man <laughs> 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 yeah Right, what we've got now, mate, because we've got to get some songs I know, we're in less of us now. We've got the theme all the way yeah, from South your, London. One of your favourite bands. I love the theme. Here we go. Just saying? Yeah, but they did sing that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like it. Well, we're almost towards the end of the show, aren't we? We are. It's been fun packed, hasn't it? It's been mad, hasn't How it? How busy have we been? Busy is a really, really thing that's really busy. Yeah. And we've got loads of music as well that we haven't played. There's some of the stuff that I've been given yep. that we need to get onto next week's show. Because mm-hmm. we we just literally cleared the backlog, haven't we? We, we sort almost, of, yeah, we've got almost. a couple that we've got to play. How about the biscuit tin? Is the biscuit tin on tonight? Oh, I need you to have a look at my phone as well. Yes. Because my, yeah. my my tuning keeps going straight to Facebook. Oh, of course, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll have to have a look at that, yeah. So I don't know, I want it to go back so I can start. Mm. Are, we, are we doing the daily biscuit tin Monday to Thursday? We always Tell me do. all about we it. We always do. Yeah. yeah. And that is back-to-back, non-stop yep, from songs five. from the Biscuit Boys playlist from 5, from five till five. 7. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then Friday we mash it up a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah. Let's have it. What's next? Uh, this is joint, joint pop. Do you want me glasses? I can see it. It's joint pop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sing a song for 
Gabby's decided to be a great time to just yeah, boys, to just bugger off while um, <laughs> I'm back. I was just it checking. It doesn't matter now, does it? Ah, uh, yes. Uh, you're just so slick. Yeah. Is there another song playing now? Then no. There's another song to come. Yeah. Another two songs to come. Yeah. I know. Then we're done. So we're going to play um, Phoenix Calling. Who's this? Who's this? Then where's uh, this come from? By uh, um, Wasted Life. Hello. Who Wait, sent by? this in? It's going to be our friend. It's always our friend. Oh, it's Emma again. Yeah. It's yeah, kiss kiss. Yeah, kiss kiss. Plug in. We'll call her kiss kiss. Yeah. Do you remember that song? There was a song that to kiss kiss. Uh, kiss kiss. Wasn't there, no. Chasing shadows in the sun until the 
That's right, yeah. I'm trying to think what the album's from. It's from Forget Your Ghosts. Ah, there's another ghost theme. There's a thread of ghosts yeah. running through this show That's as right, well. Yeah, yeah. The artist is called Phoenix Calling and the song was called Wasted Life. I like the line about drowning. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thought remember you, it like, you? I thought you were swimming for now. <laughs> 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 Well, then we're going to go out on a... We're um, going to go out on my my favourite tune of the week. Next week, my track of the week will be Class Side Time. But this week, it's... We didn't say this properly last week. Didn't we? Don't let... I'm not going to look at anything, right? Okay. It's... Paddy's Tune... (laughs) (laughs) Paddy's Tune... And it's Mother Something. Yes, close, close. Right. I know it's featuring featuring Tanya Tate. Yeah, Tanya's Tate. Yeah. <laughs> and it, I know it's called Reflections of a Disco Ball. Yeah, you know. And I love this track. Jimmy Starr yeah. sent it. So this is our star from afar. More news about Jimmy Starr next week. Yeah. So uh, it's a good night from me. Thank you. God bless. It's been a ball. Oh. oh. Good night. Oh.